hey, 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 on to the next piece of our training. And it's really all about consistency and creating a schedule, creating a game plan, a roadmap to really help you be successful, okay? And so what do we do every single day? You're a business owner, you ultimately get to decide. And for me, I wanted to make a lot of money and I wanted to make it quickly and I wanted it to be money that I could count on. And so I knew I was gonna work my business six days a week. I was gonna take a Sabbath, six days a week working my business and my goal was to enroll customers and distributors every day. I wanted new people coming into my business every single day. Now, does that happen? No, but am I doing the work to make it happen? Absolutely. And what happens as you get potential customers, as you get potential distributors, you put them all in, they all just kind of come into this funnel, right? Because you've planted the seed. They're all in your garden. And um, as you make posts, as you continue to follow up, as you put up story slides, if you talk, as you talk about your products, as you personally get results, you share the results of other people on our team or the results of the customers that you have. As you do all of those things, that's what waters your seed, right? And that's what makes people have the value, have the trust, have the want and the need to have what you want, which is ultimately going to help you sign customers. Okay. And so I was a school teacher prior to doing this business. And so worksheets are my jam. Organization is my jam. And so a couple of things that I recommend that's really going to help set you up for success is first to get yourself a planner. Okay. So I just got this one off of Amazon. They have some that are you know, at the dollar store, whatever you need, but make sure that you get yourself a planner. And one thing that I do every Sunday is I sit down and I write down the Zoom calls that I'm going to be on, the people I need to follow up with, the things I need to remember to do. Like I'm treating my business like a business. I'm scheduling myself out like a CEO would. Okay, so get yourself a planner and make sure that you just you just start scheduling things because if you fail to plan, then you plan to fail and we don't want that for anybody. Now, I did post... Um, Okay, let me back up. I didn't post this. Um, we have different daily task sheets, okay? And what these are is we call them key performance indicators, KPIs. Um, it's showing proof of you working your business. And I've created a variety of different ones and you ultimately can pick the one that works for you. So I just wanted to show you, you can purchase one of these action workbooks. If you just go to Tamika Davis on Facebook, in my profile there is uh, my website link. If you just go in there, you can go and get this, but every single one of these books has an undated calendar and a volume tracker because you're going to need that when you rank promote, they have a diamond chart, a four and a friend. And depending on when you're watching this video, you know, it might be updated. It might be a little bit different, but essentially all the tools that you need to work your business. There's an enrollment tracker sheet, a follow-up sheet, and then a place for you to be clear on your daily method of operations, place for you to write down some ideas as far as what you can post about and your time block schedules. Okay. Now, um, you don't have to use all of these pages. There's even a page here for notes. You don't have to use all of these pages. However, these, this is what I found that I use that's helpful for me in having a successful business. Okay. So all that is at the very beginning. And then, like I said, I have a variety of these. And so there's actually three of them that you can pick from. I'm going to show you all three. And like I said, it's just a roadmap to make sure that you're actually working your business like a business. Sometimes I feel like, oh my gosh, I worked so hard today. And then I look at my thing and I'm like, oh, I worked so hard in this one area. I didn't work so hard in all these other areas. And I'm the kind of person I want to catch a lot of fish. I want to sign a lot of customers. So that means I got to put a lot of lines out in the water. And so I've got to be doing this and that and the other and like all of the things every day so I can put more people in my funnel so I can water them through my consistency and then be able to sign them up as a customer. Okay. And so workbook number one, I call it my 10 tens. And, um, you know, I always start my morning with affirmations, gratitudes, process of becoming like, I always start my morning with, um, reflecting on the good. So it puts me in a good mind state. Um, you, there is this calendar. So in case if you don't buy a planner, you know, you can plan your day right here specifically and prioritize your top five things to do. Now I am always planting seeds. So I'm sending good vibe messages, asking people to host a post. I'm sending potential loyal customer messages with potential distributors. I'm working on follow-ups and I'm always expanding my network and adding friends. And so every time I do 10 of these things, I just go ahead and mark it off. And my goal is 10, 10 or three tens on all of these. Now, does that happen every day? No, 
but I can definitely see the work that I'm putting in. Okay, then there's some posting content. If you need help with that, you can check those things off as you complete it. And then business, working your business like a business, personal development, charting, setting goals, connecting with teammates, connecting with your customers, checking your downline orders, and attending a Zoom. So this is workbook number one, a key performance indicator, something to help keep you on track. If this could help you, make sure that you get your hands on it, okay? Then workbook number two, I call five fives. Okay, once again, I'm starting the day with affirmations and gratitude. I'm writing down my goals here. Maybe I'm writing down, you know, a journal prompt or my feelings or whatever I want in this box. Once again, you got the plan to succeed, planning out your day. And then you have these five boxes with five lines. This is where you are getting like actual names, like you have the people. And if you get more than five, great. But your goal every single day is to get five people to host a post for you, start five new conversations with people that you haven't talked to before or haven't talked to in a while, um, get five people to take a look at your business, whether you know, you're know you inviting them to a Zoom call or sending them a video or just some information about what we do, five people to look at your business, five people to look at your products, and then five people that you follow up with that you get a date or you get a for sure yes or a for sure no. Like, yes, I can sign up on Friday payday or no, this isn't something that I'm looking for or um, um, yes, I'm still interested, but you're going to have to check back with me next month or whatever, you know, maybe it's next week, next month, but you're, you know, you're, you're getting a response back from five people that you've already planted the seed with. And just remember that no doesn't mean not ever. It just means not right now. I said no for 10 months. I'm here. I'm loving this business. I've been here for over seven years now. I'm so grateful that the person that I said no to did not give up on me. And I know that's going to be the same true for you. Now, this is workbook number three. This is one that is actually my favorite. It kind of does a combination of book one and book two together. And so I do a journaling Zoom every single morning. And so I do my journal um, response right here. And then I have affirmations, gratitudes, and I'm setting my goals or any reminders. And so at the very beginning of the month, I actually go through and I write all of the today is you know, for the whole entire month. And so if someone says I can sign up on the 17th, I go to the 17th and I write Brenda or, you know, whatever name of the person. So that's kind of what I use here for reminders. That way I can get those follow-ups. Okay. Then at the very beginning, it's taking care of you, personal development, exercise, supplements, water. Okay. If you are not right, your business isn't going to be right. Every day, my goal is to get up 10 host to post. So every time I get a host to post, I check, 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 check. Um, I post three to five times on my wall every single day. So I check, check, check. I upload TikToks and Reels. My goal is three every day. I post on my stories. I'm trying to do this every hour. So there's 10 blocks on there for you to be able to cross those off. Um, getting in new conversations. For me, I'm doing 100 a day. I want more, so I'm doing more. I'm doing 100 a day. So each one of these blocks to me represents 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. So I don't mark those off until I get my 100 or 20 at a time. Um, new potential loyal customers, just like the five fives. I'm checking, checking, checking that I at least got five people to check out my list. Um, I at least got five people to talk to about the business. And for follow-ups, I got five confirmations for follow-ups, okay? So like I said, it's kind of a combination. You know, I'm 20, 20, 20 instead of 10, 10, 10. Um, and then I'm five, 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 just like before. But I just don't have a spot to write the names. But this is how I'm using it. Maybe you want to reach out to 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 potential loyal customers or 5, 10, 15, 20, 30. Like, I mean, you could use it as a set number or you could use it as I got one, I got one, I got one. Okay. Um, and then down here, I attend a Zoom call every day. I check my charts and update them and make sure that like I'm on track for what goals I have set. I connect with my teammates. I always make sure that every day I'm connecting with someone on my team or a customer that I've signed. And then I do my numbers. You know, I'm checking my downline orders, seeing what's been returned, what's declined, what's come through and all that kind of stuff. Okay. And so this is take care of business. And so each one of these booklets has 31 of these KPIs, the key performance indicators um, to get you through the whole entire month. And I have been doing this for almost a year now. And it's just so helpful to have all my follow-ups, all of my, you know, proof of work right there. Um, my calendar, like everything just in these. Okay. And so this is a business treat it like one. Okay. You got to show up every single day to work. If you don't, you're going to lose trust with your market. You know, if you think about owning a, a business on main street, if some days you were open and some days you were closed, people are just going to stop coming. If, you know, you aren't consistently, if all you are is just shoving product, 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 then people aren't going to want to come into your store. And so it's doing all of the things. I'm posting about my products. I'm posting about my business. I'm posting about me 
I'm sharing what it's doing for me. I'm um, passionate. I'm excited. I'm confident. Even on the days that I don't feel confident, I just fake it, right? Like I'm confident. I'm uplifting. I'm empowering others. And I promise you guys that when you're consistent and you treat your business like a business, it will pay like a business. I promise you that. And, um, you know, Earl, Earl Nightingale says, first, you have to add the wood before you get the fire. So first, you've got to do the work before you're going to get the fire and don't quit after you put all these logs on your fire, you know, just because you don't see it booming yet. I promise it will. So, um, I hope this was helpful. And if you guys have any questions, let me know. I will drop the link below to these workbooks in case if you want to get one yourself or send one to a teammate. Okay.